Hi guys, welcome back again to my channel guys. Today's video um, is all about S Baby Mama script on Instagram live guys having a good time to answer all questions, you know. He has a good time to answer all the questions from I am from her fans concerning her life, concerning her business, concerning her show, concerning uh, you know everything, her baby guys. So in this live video, without wasting much time, let's keep watching. Make sure you subscribe, drop your opinion, comment section, what it thinks, and. Uh, Today is the first time. Show some love by subscribing. And for those that are complaining, our voice record here. Please, you can skip this voice record and you watch the main video. Please, guys, we are doing this for one purpose. Um, we are so sorry about everything. But you can skip it and you watch the main video. All right, let's continue watching. I will see you on my next video. Have a wonderful day. Thanks. Okay. All right. So... I know a lot of people didn't know that um, for our show, Love and Hip Hop, we switched over to MTV, but some people know, a lot of people don't know. But the show's coming on this Tuesday, July 23rd, on MTV. I want y'all to know that, okay? See her on TikTok throwing shade. Don't start y'all. She not shading me. Well, if she is, I don't fucking care. That's my friend. Okay? We're friends again. She was calling me to come over and eat. I didn't even see. It wasn't my birthday, y'all. My daughter's birthday is this week, though. So yeah. All right, I might have to get off of here. And oh, go put on some pants. <laughs> There's some right there on the couch. When he come in here with his little underwear on, sir. Mm -mm. I'm drinking some coffee. I forgot to drink my coffee this morning because I've been putting this stuff in here. Hold on, I got this off a of TikTok shop. Hold on. Every single time I get on TikTok, I see this. Yes, y'all, tight face crew, we back officially yeah. together. Come here. <laughs> Look how Brie didn't dress for bed. He got on some little Gucci pajamas and his shirt tucked in. <laughs> Get down. You are funny. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> I'm trying to look. <laughs> Say hi, guys. <laughs> Say hi, guys. No, guys. <laughs> I don't know, y'all. I don't know how it is. I guess I'm gonna have to wait um, to see. Like, I don't really know what I'm supposed to be looking for, to be honest. Breland's five. So this week, um, Callie's gonna be three and Zylo's three. So I'm gonna have two three, year, two, three year olds. Maybe the same age for like a little over a week. And it's so ghetto when we go out in public. I'm like, how old is she? How old is she? They're both three. Are they twins? No. No, they not twins. You know, I was just back to back in it. I can't believe that. That's actually kind of, um, yeah, that's ghetto, y'all. Yeah. Is get home. I'm eating some cheesecake. 
my guilty pleasure go to the cheesecake factory and order about four slices crazy they are like 11 months apart so I want more kids I don't wow I don't necessarily mind that's my candy day where Right on there. Okay. You ready to go get in your bed? No. Why not? Because I need to watch one more video. Okay, go watch one more video. All right. Cheesecake and coffee. It's not good. I, I love cheesecake and coffee. It was, when you say insane, what does that mean? Tips on how to keep the waist so slim. I'll be wearing this waist trainer I got from this place. I posted this place called Forma, right? And they do um, body contouring. And honestly, I was like, I'm not gonna go over here and waste my time because I thought that body contouring was literally only for people who got surgery. And I was like, I'm not about to go waste my time. Yeah, I'm not gonna be doing all this shit and it don't work. But I actually like, I had some great results from one session. And they gave me a, um, a waist trainer and she told me to wear it like six hours a day. So that's what I've been doing on top of, you know, my normal workouts and stuff. I do Pilates probably like, I try to at least go two times a week, but I haven't been in the past two weeks. And no, I did not get a C-section. I had all three like, you know, yeah, that way. You want to see the waist trainer? I don't know. I got it right here, too. Hold on. This is it. It is so good, too. This is the company. I'm pretty sure you can go on their website and grab one, but I just grabbed it when I was um, in their office. But it has a zipper. You zip it up. And then you do the little Velcro things. But it's late as hell and I'm drinking coffee. I uh, know. But you, you know what's crazy? Coffee, can't nothing keep me awake. I'm like one person. I don't care what I drink. I don't care if it's a Red Bull, whatever it is. Like, I'm definitely going to sleep as soon as I lay down. This is it. Yeah, of course, I still have bundles and stuff. It's on, um, everything's on houseofshimmer.com. And for this stuff, I don't have a link for it, but I'm telling y'all, every time I opened up TikTok, I saw ads about this, like people selling it on their lives and all kind of stuff. So, um, activity or animal seen on that deck. Okay, let's see what kind of animals we got out here tonight. Because the deer got on my um, deck the other night. We spilled some, um, some of the deer food. But we spilled some of the food and then one of them went up there on the deck. Oh, thank you, uh, Melanin Popping. You looking like you scared of deer? Yeah, I am. No, I don't have no curtains right here. That's the back of my house. Not to race there. Oh, for the waist trainer, it's this one. For my, if you go in my, um, look at my reels, I posted a reel and I tagged them. 
um and you can see the whole service they have these and a few different like cities i went to one in alpharetta i know they have one in like miami um they have them in a few different cities so they may have it in your city wherever you at I love you guys too. Will I ever move back to Compton? Probably not. But I might move somewhere nearby. Do I wear my natural hair out ever? Not really. I got some of it out though in this ponytail. I took the um the fake ponytail off. I just have a frontal right here on the front. But yeah, I don't wear my real hair out because, you know, it's just, it's just not time for that for me. You must have missed the first few minutes of the live. I was telling y'all about um, Love & Hip Hop this season. Hey, Poochie girl. But yeah, <clears throat> so I put that collagen in my coffee and I put some cream. That's it. That's it. What do I want to try that I haven't in terms of what? Wait, I'm missing some of these questions. Am I voting? Of course. What do I do to stay happy? Hmm. I think just like taking time for myself and like when I go to the gym or if I'm doing like any kind of physical activity, working out, playing basketball, like just doing anything like that, that's like, that's my peace. So I gotta make sure I do that, you know what I'm saying? And then I feel like the rest of my day be kind of smooth sailing once I take some time for myself. I work a lot. My kids, they are like super duper duper amazing. So, you know, y'all in this dating is crazy. I definitely be missing LA a lot, but I, I go home. Well, I haven't been home this year too much, but normally. I'll be there. Now watch the WNBA. I normally try to catch a couple of games, but I haven't this year. Like I literally been doing the most. I haven't been able to do a lot of stuff I want to do this year. Oh, this is what I was going to tell y'all. Cause somebody had asked about the, the abs and the workouts and all this stuff. So what I was doing wrong for a long time was just doing regular like crunches, like going back and up. And so when I went to that place, Forma, the owner, she was like, you can't do that because you have diastasis. And that's like, she put her fingers in between like my stomach. So it's like a gap in between the muscles. So my stomach was like spread apart from giving birth um i guess it can happen from like if your babies are too big or if you have kids back to back or whatever so anyways um yeah i have that so i have to do stuff on the side like planks and um obliques 
yeah i was like dang i've been spreading that thing even more apart is it similar to a hernia i'm not sure but um i had never heard of it i didn't even knew i didn't even know that that was a thing but um apparently i was just kind of you know making my stomach like <sighs> here's the thing i was trying to figure out why my waist wasn't shrinking and getting smaller i'm like i ain't got no fat over here so what's happening but it was just the muscles separating so wearing a waist trainer and like doing the proper exercises has been helping it and it's been like helping like really really quick like the results are um you know coming in fast once i once i figured out that i was on the wrong stuff so now somebody said what do you do now i do like when i do pilates they have you do work on your obliques obliques or whatever they call a lot so i do that and then she said it's fine if i do like the planks but nothing just going like back and up and that was like my shit Um, y'all can stop asking about a man because I'm not going to answer. I'm sorry. Yeah, I still have, um, hair on my website, houseofshimmer.com, shimmereliteextensions.com. I got my nails done at this place called Tara Nails in Atlanta. And I did my um, lashes and my brows. How far apart are my children? Breland's five, Zylo's three, Callie's two. Yeah, y'all, I ain't gonna answer no questions about no guy. Am I still a sneakerhead? <laughs> I wouldn't necessarily consider myself a sneakerhead, but I got some. Got a little collection. Kids' books. I was supposed to be dropping Callie's book. Um, actually, a while ago. But I've been having some issues with the... Um, illustrations on hers so hopefully hers will be out soon as soon as we get it together um i told you what what's your name baker honestly i i just said i'm not going to answer any questions about dating because yeah, I'm just not. Is this a wig? No. Well, it's not a whole wig. It's just a frontal. It's just a frontal. Hey, comrade. Yes. Okay. They definitely harassing me. Can I send your kids some watches? They don't know how to tell time. Are they digital? Hold on. It says something out here again. Let me see. See what we got. I don't see nothing out there. It must be. Must have been like a bird or something. I ain't gonna be no wholesome, no baddies. They ain't gonna try to square up with my ass. I'm tired of fighting. Mm 
Mm. No, ma'am. Sierra, I heard you was talking shit about me on TikTok today. What happened? What I do now? What did I, and they, they was on here being messy. They talking about Sierra was calling you, trying to see if you can um come over for dinner. I said, she did not call me. She didn't call me. I'm on here telling these people I'm drinking collagen peptides so we can keep our tight faces. And I told them the tight face crew is back in action, period. I ain't gonna lie, I think this stuff be making me a little drunk. Like the collagen. When I be drinking it in the morning, I'll be like, what's up? Be getting a little, I don't know. Hey, Jessica girl. I wish your advice on a mama's boy. <laughs> and we got a baby on the way. Um, First of all, the first thing you want to do with a mama's boy is... Okay, that's it. Okay, so what is the collagen supposed to do, y'all? For real, tell me. And when am I supposed to start noticing results? Because I've been drinking this thing for like two and a half weeks. And I don't know if my face is getting tighter. I don't know. I can't tell. Yeah, bitch. We ain't finna be wrinkled face crew. You can't see the results because I got a filter on here. I take the filter off. Y'all gonna be like, hold on now, bam. Go ahead and go put a little something. I be having this little darkness up under my eyes for real. And my skin... It's pretty clear, so. Skincare products. I've been using this stuff from, um, okay, you know this person on here called Porsar? They, what's the name of the, um, the place? Um, Charette Cosmetics. <clears throat> so I went there, probably like, it's probably been like a month now and I got a facial and I got PRP, which was, okay, let me tell y'all what happened because this was crazy. They took my blood, right? They took my blood and they said they were going to do PRP under my eyes and I assumed it was going to be like a little micro needling. Man, that thing stuck that thing in my, I was like, ooh. It hurts so, it hurts so bad and I was not prepared for it. So I got the PRP treatment up under my eyes, um, but apparently I need to do it again a few more times to see some results, but I don't know if I can because it hurt. It hurt. I ain't gonna do it. Where are the babies? Well, guys, it's um, it's ten eighteen, so they in bed. Breathing, he's still roaming around. But I'm about to. Hey, I'm about to go to bed too. I'm only up this late because um. I don't know. I don't even know why. I don't even have a reason. I'm about to go ahead and call it on white. Okay. Turmeric soap. Okay. All right. Well, y'all can um send me some suggestions. Please subscribe.